The Mount Rogers National Recreation Area is one of my favorite places to backpack with its uh, high elevation grassy fields like our campsite here, granite ridges, the wild ponies. We started at the Elk Garden Trailhead hike to where the Red Arrow is, which is the Briar Ridge Gap uh, uh, and where we camped. And this is the backpacking group. Yay! A movie. Everybody say yay. Yay! <laughs> okay, great. And here's our route going in on the Virginia Highlands Horse Trail in blue, going out on the Appalachian Trail in red, and doing a day hike in green to the Thomas Knob Shelter. Here we're starting to hike uh, up the uh, Virginia Highlands Horse Trail. Uh, it's about two and a half miles to uh, the Briar Ridge uh, Gap, uh, which we're uh, to the camp at. And here's our view, first view of Briar Gap and Briar Gap Ridge there. So the campsite is there in that gap. Okay, now what is this going to signify? All for one and one for all. Okay, I don't think Donald Trump would subscribe to that. He, he would say all for me and me and for and me for me, <laughs> right? <laughs> After the open areas at the beginning of the trail, uh, the trail traverses gradually through a forest up uh, to Briar Creop, and there comes a trail runner. Good trail for trail running, as it uh, it's, has a gradual climb. And after two miles or so in the woods, Here's where we break out onto the grassy gap, known as Briar Ridge Gap. And Briar Ridge Gap. Nothing but grass, trees up there, the AT up there, and camping in between. And there's the rest of our group waiting on us. The end. The end. Well, I'll get to the end. Oh, the, the campsite's another mile that way. <laughs> we have our packs down there. And down where? Bodies here. Down where? There's another fire ring down there. Oh, okay. Well, the view toward these mountains. Yeah. 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 But we don't know where the water is, so I, we want to be. I'll show you in just a minute then. Well, we got to camp around 2:30, 3:40 or so. The tents are set up, uh, and the rest of our group are going to walk out the Thomas Divide uh, or Knob uh, Shelter which is on the next ridge over. Somewhere right there, I think. Well, this is a fantastic uh, place to camp, Briar Gap, Briar Ridge Gap. Uh, that uh, dark mountain in the distance is White Tops. There's a road almost to the top of it. We started right down there. You can kind of almost see the uh, uh, well, you can see the highway, maybe. And uh, came up uh, those ridges there and up to the gap here. Standing right in the middle of the uh, Briar Ridge Gap. I guess that's Briar Ridge up there and also uh, going on around over there. I just walked around looking for campsites and there are no real campsites, good campsites, except in this grassy area. And uh, now I'm walking up toward the top of the uh, gap. And uh, here are our tents. Blue tent is Bruce and Kathy. The uh, white and orange one over there is Amy and me. 
big rock in between all of us that we'll cook beside. And down there is Cindy's camp tent. And uh, the rest of them are again hiking over to the Thomas Knob shelter, which is somewhere up in that gap right there. They went out through there and around and over. Gotten a bit cloudy, but it's still over 70, and it's kind of a cool wind now and then. Uh, but uh, still some good sunshine, also, and just a beautiful place to be. Okay, big problem. Everything's gone perfect except always before, and I've been here at least five times or so. There's been water right down there. Uh, good water at this time. Didn't find any. Followed that drainage down. Really, really bad walking. It's totally no trails at all. Blackberry bushes and everything else. And finally, down there below those trees in a really deep gorge, hard to get into, hard to get out of. I found some water. Not much, but enough. Great campsite, but not too good without water. And there's always been water right there. Here's a still photo of where the water used to be at red and where I finally found it way down there in white. If we eat? Oh yeah, first gourmet dish coming up is ramen noodles. Just plain old ramen noodles, mm. right? <laughs> yeah. Mm. What is that? Is that cheese? Yes. Okay. All right. Very good. And wine. And wine. Whoa. Here, pour that wine. And the second gourmet dish is, what do you mm. call it? <laughs> kind of pasta salad. Garbage. <laughs> Garbage. Garbage can spaghetti. <laughs> right. Pasta a la Cindy. <laughs> and Amy and I are having Hungarian goulash for me. And uh, yeah. mushroom pot pie for Amy. <laughs> They're now uh, hydrating. After dinner, we had one of the most beautiful sunsets we've seen uh, to the west, of course, uh, and we went up on top of the uh, gap and, uh, and watched it as it unfolded and, and developed. And, yeah, it was so pretty. Uh, uh, most notable was a line of red along the bottom of it. And here are a couple of still photographs of the sunset. First, uh, the sun just dropping below the mountains to the west, and then uh, a while after the sun had uh, set. Uh, after a perfect night for sleeping, 50 degrees or so, we woke to a equally perfect uh, morning dry, no chance of rain. And then after breakfast, the ponies visited. Oh my God, y'all, that was magic. I just like, go. They're at our campsite now. That's a beautiful shot there of the yeah. I really like this still photograph of the uh, two ponies grazing. Here's a group photograph just before we left camp. Hey, here we go, leaving camp. Everybody say something profound. What a great time. Great time. We saw a unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Cindy, you got anything for Amy? Looking back at Briar Ridge Gap. We met up with the others at Deep Gap, shown here, where there used to be an AT shelter, and then followed the Appalachian Trail back to the trailhead. And here we're heading on down from Deep Gap, where we saw a bunch of people, two small groups, <laughs> and uh, then over there, they're getting ready to take off. 
is a huge group from Black Mountain. It's a camp of like, I don't know, 15 guys probably. It's been woods up until now. And there's White Top Mountain. This is the group that we saw earlier. And some cows that are here to keep the uh, balls clear. Uh, they also have longhorns, which are much for, for, more ferocious looking. These guys are from Troutdale. They were camped back at Deep Gap. So coming across the last grassy ridge and heading down to the Elk Garden trailhead. There, which is below White Top Mountain. Well, so, sorry to be so late and sorry to hold you up. We're not. We're fine. fine, okay. <laughs> okay. We know who our friends are. Right, right. <laughs>